What's up guys, Caleb here from SRKCycles.com and you are looking at a 2007 Harley Davidson uh, Electric Glide Standard. Really good looking bike. This is pretty much the bare bones of the touring family. Uh, but it's a really good looking bike, you know, it's got, it's got around 40,000 on it. Um, really, you know, it's a nice shape, something that if you're just looking to get into the, if you're just starting to get into the touring line, you don't know if you want a touring bike yet, but you want to kind of experiment with it, this is definitely the bike for you. Uh, this is the walk around video, so I'm going to show you exactly what's wrong with this bike. Starting here in the back, it does have a little bit, it looks like someone knocked up against that a little bit right there. Uh, but this has some Vance and Heinz pipes on it. Bags are in good shape, you know, it's got a couple scratches here on the back, if you can see that right there. Um, you know, bags are in good shape though, chrome's in pretty good shape. It does have these aftermarket covers on the floorboards with the Willie G skull. Um, you know, pipes, pipes aren't perfect, they got some scratches on them for sure. Um, but the chrome looks pretty good. From up there, six-speed transmission with a 96 cubic inch engine. Uh, this is not gonna have cruise control, I don't believe. Um, so you know, it's, it's kind of bare bones. Got some highway Willie G rider highway pegs there. Does have a dent in the fork slider right there? You can see that. Wheels definitely need to clean up a little bit. They got a white wall, but it's kind of getting blue. Um, Got some scraping down back there with a little bit of rust. Just some scraping right there. Uh, front fender looks pretty good. I don't really see any dents. Looks like that piece is off a little bit. And that piece is off a little bit, so it looks like it's a little bit crooked. Um, like I said, a little more down there. Uh, you know, the chrome on this side's not perfect. Engine definitely is a little bit, looks a little worn. Like I said, guys, you know, this is a pretty entry-level touring. It's not going to be that expensive. Got a scratch right there, if you can see that. But this side of the, these saddlebags are pretty good. So that's a little scratch right there. A couple of little scratches on the top. Looks pretty good. A um, couple little scratches on the back there. Seat's actually really nice. Uh, there is one little hole right there, but besides that, it's really nice. Top of the tank's in pretty good shape. I'm not seeing any dings or dents. Um, maybe a little ding right there, but you can't really see it with the skull stuff. And a little ding right there. Like I said, guys, 40,000 on it. Now, the battery is a little bit weak on this, um, so please forgive me when I start it up. One thing to note, the, um, the for some reason, the, the face of this is gone. So I'm sure if you put a CD in there, it would work. Uh, I don't know how you would change change this, change everything. Um, but that is, the, for some reason, the face of that is gone. I don't know why. Uh, you know, this is a little faded out here, faded here. You know, there's some fade spots along the fairing. You can see those. You know, I always recommend people just get it painted. That way, you know, you don't have to worry about that. Nice big tall clear windshield. Let's see this bad boy fire up. It did do it for me. A little bit of a struggle, like I said, guys. Um, you know, battery's not 100% going to charge it up. Uh, but you know, it idles nicely. It's got nice fans and hides on it. Yeah, it's got some nice fans and hides on it. Good sounding bike, good looking bike. Like I said, right around 40,000 miles, guys. Uh, definitely make sure to check out the test drive video on this bike uh, that me or Sean do. Um, and definitely see if it's something you're interested in. We have a couple other bikes, some Ultra Limiteds. Um, we just got a Rogue Glide in, see, compare and contrast them, see which ones you like better. Uh, but yeah, this is a super good looking bike. I'm sure the price is going to blow your mind. Press will be posted below the video as well as on our website, srkcycles.com. Subscribe to the channel. Follow us on Instagram at srkcycles. Thanks a ton for watching, guys.